ahead and talk with yeah. Caleb Plank. Can you tell us about where the, um, you know, if you just want to go ahead and tell us specifically, but I believe that there was a tweet that Caleb Truex, and Caleb, I will let you respond to this, but for Caleb Plant, the champ, you know, the, the, the tweet that was sent out a few years ago, did you use it as bulletin material heading into this fight against your challenger? Uh, yeah, that's something that's definitely been a motivating factor. You know, uh, with only 11 fights, wherever he was in his career, whatever he was doing, you know, for him to, you know, hope that I get knocked out or, you know, only room enough for one Caleb or whatever silly shit he was saying, you know, instead of wishing for somebody else to knock me out, why don't you step up and do it? You know, that, that's big talk come from someone who had as many fights as you have when I only have 11 fights. You know, why would someone like me even be on your radar uh, at a point in time like that? But now, you know, look, the tables are turned and uh, all that determinate, you know, my determination and, you know, my pressure. Every guy I fight, they've had determination. Every guy I fight, they come to bring the pressure. Every guy I fight, they come to walk me down. They come to cut off the ring. And what happens? I wind up throwing more punches than them. I wind up landing more punches than them, whether it's Jose Uzgatagi or any of the last two guys I fought. So, you know, all that sounds good. It sounds good for the media, but when that bell rings, it's a different story.